So, you guys, I am sitting here with Hannah Lloyd, who plays Diana on Grimm. <laughs> so, for those few people who do not watch the show, could you tell us a little bit about Grimm the Show and your character? So, Grimm the Show <laughs> is kind of a twist on the Grimm's, like, brother's fairy tales. Mm -hmm. And they bring monsters and witches into it. And they have this Grimm that starts killing the bad ones. But he decides to leave the good ones alone. Mm -hmm. So it kind of just keeps going. And then relationships are made. And, you know. <laughs> you know, <laughs> like, like, like it does, like it happens. So uh, her character is awesome and is having a major storyline this season. Mm -hmm. So we have a small clip to show you some of the, the awesomeness that her character does. It's a pretty short clip. Are you coming with us? You have to come with us. I want her to come now. Diana, look at me. I'm right here. I just need a little more time. Okay. Uh, the show is awesome, and her character, you saw the eyes glowing, and like in the last one from last week, uh, she, uh, she can just like levitate and move things, and so she's, she's beating up this guy, and she's flipping him back and forth across the room, just by like sitting there and moving her hand. Yeah. It's so <laughs> creepy, you guys. <laughs> so, is this your first major acting role? It is, but I have done like theater at my local high school, Prairie High School, and I've been doing that since I was eight. So um, you're 13 now, right? Yes. So she's been, so she's 13. She's been doing theater at Prairie since she was eight. How did you get into that? Um, my mom used to work at the school, and she was friends with the director, Claire Verity. And she kind of just needed a kid, and so my mom was like, do you want to do it? And I was like, sure. And so I started doing it, and then I just kept doing it from there on because of I've just grown like relationships with her daughter and her, and now I'm like one of the family. That's awesome. So on Grimm, uh, you, there are a lot of effects, like in the entire show, but also specifically for your character. Mm -hmm. So do they do all of that in post-production? Um, not all of it. Most of the special effects are in post-production, but usually the guys come in and they tell me like where to put my hand if I'm gonna hold a jar. Mm -hmm. or something like that. But for like stunts, we usually do that there and they're like, you know, like so if something happens, just be aware and yeah, it's kind of scary, but <laughs> you know. But she's got it. <laughs> it's, it's awesome. So how far in advance do you get your script? Um, like a week or days Oh before, my gosh. Like three days usually. And you have to like memorize the whole thing? Yes. <laughs> I'm like, I use cues, oh my god, you guys. <laughs> um, so how do you prepare? So me and my mom usually sit down and we just like read the script and we keep reading it back and forth and then we put the script away so I don't see it so I can't just like read off of it mm -hmm. and I just try to say it to her over and over again and then finally I kind of just get it yeah. and I memorize it. So. so do you read the whole script? I don't. I just read what my character knows because I feel like that's going to prepare me better for my character. That makes sense. So, um, let's see, so you read the script, so you do all that. Uh, <laughs> I'm just like, I'm so amazed. I mean, she's, she's 13 and she's doing all of this. How do you do all of it? So, are you in school right now? I am. I actually do online school, but last year I was in public school, middle school. So. And how do you balance all of that? Um, it's really hard, but I kind of have, like, I always have a lot going on because I don't like to be, like, bored or anything, so <laughs> it's kind of just always worked out for me. Mm -hmm. I mean, it is, like, it does get kind of stressful at times, but it always works out, and I kind of just go with it, you Nice. Know? Now, filming for the show has wrapped for this season. Yes. So can you tell us how it ends? No. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. Sorry, you guys. I'll work harder. So, uh, so, uh, so shooting is over now. Um, what, what's next for you? 
Well, I don't have much next, but I am, like I keep going on auditions and I'm gonna try to keep pursuing acting, mm -hmm. but there is a stand-in that was on Grin and he wrote a um, like script for me. And so some directors were like, oh, I like that. So we are going to be filming that local in Portland really soon and we're gonna see if it gets picked up, so. That's awesome. Well, you'll have to let us know so that if it gets picked up, we can let all of these folks know mm -hmm. because people are, as you can tell, pretty interested in your career and what's going on. Yes. So I have one last question for you, which is like, do you have like a favorite moment or story from filming Grimm? Um, probably not a favorite because there's honestly been so much that's so great and everything. But a funny story is my dad actually got to be in one of the episodes. Oh my gosh. And it was this much of him, but, <laughs> but he was holding my hand and they took a picture and they showed the picture and everyone was like, I don't see your hands. Because it was kind of like black and white and it was all crumpled up picture mm. that Meisner picked up. But um, he still thinks that he's there and that. <laughs> So, if Hannah's dad asks, great cameo in the show, good work. <laughs> well, that's awesome. So, if people want to follow you, are you on Facebook or Instagram? Um, I'm on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. She's like, on everything. Yeah. I'm on everything. That's awesome. Well, so you guys, check her out. Follow what she's doing. She's doing incredible work right now. We know she's going to be doing a lot more. Hannah, thank you so much for joining us and being on the show. Thank you.